Anyway, let us continue, shall we? I was going to put him on the short date. No, we're starting now. We're starting now. Damn. It was going to be entertaining for. Oh, yeah, that would be an easy one to have to get that, like. Yeah. Yeah. I can't even do the lake sound without. And I don't like editing these. I'm sorry. But editing these. If I really wanted to edit them and cut out all the boring bits, like when we're, we're not saying anything, take me fucking days. <laughs> Good. Movie Maker doesn't leave much to the imagination. You gotta get cre you gotta get creative, but it's still fun. But it still works anyway. Anyway, where we left off, you guys just went to bed. Day two. Breakfast. <laughs> Brecky. Yay. You did it the first time. So you guys making the fire and everything. Yeah, mate, we're making fire and breakfast. Your nights were uneventful, by the way. Both yeah, of you. <laughs> well, I could have made it eventful. That's quite but a lie. Cool. I enjoyed the sleep. Sure you did. Well, well, energized for another day. Sure you did. With you that wake, mark on your you face, wake you up sure well-rested. Things that happen in games that I wish happened in real life. You, you, you wish you slept well-rested, but with that scar on your face. Blackie? Leave the pop alone. No. What about it? Is it in vain? No. It's, it's burning, dude. It's just there. <laughs> I just, just say, like, random shit because it's funny. <laughs> that scar on your face totally the reason why you can't sleep. It's not like it summons demons every well, time you go to bed. Well, let's start walking down to breakfast. Yep, remember I have to pack up I like how nobody then. heard what I just said. Especially not the paladin. It. And I'm not repeating it. I heard me, it. What did I say? D E N L. I don't want to finish it because he's going to freak. <laughs> it's not actually happening. I'm just fucking oh, okay. you. <laughs> Something about like summoning demons. Your scars. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking, obviously. No, it's for some. It's something else. It's actually related to Andy's story. Why you have the scar. Okay. Yeah. That's not for later, though. Oh, one bonus. I need to say this before we continue. One bonus for you jo going with, if you are with us when we go to do hers, you get to see your kids. Oh, yay. Yeah. Because they're in the Elven Kingdom. Not in the drought part, obviously. Because if they're in the drought part, they, they, they wouldn't be lasty long. <laughs> they would be slaves. They would be better. Or dead. Or both. I uh, know we like using other elven, uh, other elves. Not necessarily. But here's the thing: they're in peace right now, but there's a chance of civil Why war. Why do you think happening. I let my s s what is it? My sister. Oh yeah, my sister. No, that's Moon Elf. No, you like Tusk War. Anyway, shall we continue? Lee, you wake up in the morning, and Hilda's not there. <laughs> yeah, Neither is your cat. He's going huh? He's going to break his nuts chopped. What's going on? Hilda, or, nor your cat are in the room. What the heck? Upset, wake up. <laughs> yeah, I'm upset. Who the fuck? Okay. Where is everybody? That cat's garbage. What the hell? What am I saying? Fluff in my mouth. I hope that Jeez. wasn't in character. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you got that. What are you doing? Uh, um, okay. Well, I'm gonna get up, dress, move the chain to the door. <laughs> it's not like she 
can open them, but they're still kind of, you kind of got to move them to get out of the hut, get out of the room. Uh, hi, there. So you're leaving the room? Yeah. All right, let me explain something right now. When you open the door, you're suddenly hit with a smell of rancid, like, decay. What you see is everyone you know impaled in front of you, dead, rotting, right in front of you, as you open the door. Suddenly, you right now, I'm gonna suddenly, no, no, no. Um, suddenly, you actually wake up. What the? Fuck? And Hilda is actually next to you. Yeah, I still, I'm, yeah, I'm starting crying. Fuck you, that wasn't <laughs> funny. <laughs> Sorry. The dream inside of a dream. Huh? The dream inside of a dream. Yeah, it's a dream. That's old school. Dream. Whoa. It got her, though. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, what the fuck? What Hilda is still fuck? fast asleep. Proper quiet, your face. That was back in the early 80s. <laughs> no. Leave me alone. The movie I saw was back in the early uh, 80s. Bear. Um. No, I'm not sure. I'm obviously, like, freaking scrambled, and no, I, like, I'm not sure. I can't think, because, like, before this skill, there was, like, I, I kind of, I was kind of, like, stuck in the underdark and abused and shit. So, like, I'm kind of, I'm still, like, kind of rattled, and I don't, I'm, like, I don't want to wake her, because, like, just seeing her She's there is such a relief. Like, I don't want, yeah. I don't want to move Yeah, and your cat them. is also, like, asleep by Yeah, you. I don't want to, I don't want to move them, and I don't want to wake them up. I freaking, I, like, I get, I get out of there. I, I literally walk out of there. Kinda. You walk out, and everything seems, is fine. 15, 16, 17. Are you trying to bite your elbow? Eight, no. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Okay, well, I got 19 for stealth, getting out of the room. Obviously, I don't wake him up. Um, check everything. She, give my head a good shake. I I literally look for the first person that I hand that to wake. So you woke up, you get out of the room, yeah. and you see uh, Cammy Hammer eating. You see Cammy Hammer eating some food, and you see uh, Taldar also eating food while Makalar is doing dishes. Taldar's the one that does. That's... He has a sword and shield. Okay. Makalar's uh, the one with the halberd. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna look for Hey, Taldar and. You know, I keep on going, I keep on, at, like, I keep on seeing stuff. You're seeing stuff? I, uh, Like, nightmares? Well, I had one, yeah, but... You're just like, starting one now? Well, no, I, I, I had, I, I just had one and... Cammy Hammer and Taldar look at each other when they say, when they say that. You had nightmares too, didn't you? We've been having nightmares since that spire arrived. It's weird that you only start getting them now. You remember? Yeah. The, you remember the dwarf, the one that died. Uh, ba Balin. Yeah. Um, I saw him last night. You too. I I like actually saw him. Like I physically saw him. Like he was. Like I can almost touch him. I saw him, and then I went to go see where he went because like he's supposed to be dead I seen him die and I went to go follow him and I I was kind of scared and I like Hilda went down the corner and I see my dad like my dad my father that's been dead since I was like little like I don't that's new one Cammy Cammy ever says yeah that is new Hmm. We'll look into it for you. It, but we might not find much. 
but yeah, the nightmare thing has been common recently since that spire first erupted. I like, it surprised was like, you haven't gotten any yet. It was like I just woke. I, I it was like I woke up from a bad dream. Like I woke up from a regular sleep, and then Enough. nobody was in the room in my room, and I came out, and everybody was dead, like slaughtered. You so you got one just like me, says Taldar. One of them almost told about it? One of them was told about one of the strange well, Actually, two of the guild members were told about Which the ones? Happened. The uh, cleric. There's no cleric? Not the cleric. The cleric that deals with all the files. Oh, yes, yes. And. Shield and Sword. Oh, Taldar? Taldar. Yeah, he knows about that. About the what happened happening. Can't. No, but he, about what happened? Yes. To me. Went to him first. Oh, that was what happened with you, but not. Yeah, they know things of odd, odd have been happening lately. They all know that. This is all new to them. There's never been any records of this happening before. Alright. Have. Do you know? <laughs> Sorry, by the way. <laughs> I, I'm trying to act as much as possible. Yeah, I know, but I wasn't <laughs> expecting you to start crying. I was like, oh no! 5% sensitivity, you kind of get touched. Thanks. Anyway! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what is it? What That's is it? That's an understatement what's, there. What's, oh, what's that thing when you can love off inanimate objects? Or is polygonal? I'm going to change think. my status to polygonal. I'm in love with an inanimate object. Actually, no, a fake object. I could be wrong, so don't quote me on that. I thought it was pansexual. No. Pansexual is when you like every sexual orientation. Uh, any gender. In theory... And just look it up. I'm time. sorry. I know I'm on my 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 no, I'm on my character. Anyways, <laughs> in theory she is. Anyway. Oh well, yeah, you're not wrong. Cause she really doesn't care. But there's yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, tell the size of you if the, the thought is kind of. The thought is kind of like it. I know who Hilda is enough that she's a dominant, dominant person. Yeah, yeah. I like how that's not the topic at him. I know. You're still it's talking scary. about the dream. It's still scary. How is it scary? <laughs> I guess everyone thinks of it differently. Okay, as a switch, I'm a dawn and. A Oh. Yeah, I know, it's weird, eh, because she's a dom and she won't let you. <laughs> she's too dom, right? Yeah. Anyways, uh, yeah, wait, are you sure, like, there's, has any been, do you, have you heard about anybody who's been, like, messing around with stuff, because, I don't know, if it, so, it, there's, I heard about uh, some whispers from a wizard that I used that I used to work for. No, actually, it's nothing. Not... What we've been finding have been completely new to us. We have no idea what has been going on, and we're trying to figure that out. Which is why the town actually keeps coming to us, and why we keep taking off. Right. I. Normally, we'd be here all day. Well, we've been taking off a lot because we've been we've been constantly being asked to help with other people and investigate. As what is everybody else seen? Uh, very similar stuff to what you just described. Like dead family members. The dream, dead family members, everyone they know dying, and they don't know what's going on. 
I'm gonna... You know what? I can't do this. I'm going to, um... I'm going into the library. I, I, I can't. I, I gotta do some research. I gotta get my mind off this. Uh, let me check if what the places in here are. The bedrooms, kitchen, storage, meeting room, training room, cellar, food pantry, the file room, the entrance area, and that's it. Okay, well, I guess I'm going into the file room. The file room is just files on uh, the stuff that we that they found and stuff that from quests and stuff they went on. Just just history of the of the guild only. Yeah, if, they, if the guild's been dealing with this area for a long period of time, they would know. The guild's actually quite recent. Yeah, it's quite recent. It's been around for a while. It was only two people who founded it for a while, and they didn't do much. It's only recently since, like, Makala and Taldar joined and you guys joined that it started growing. <laughs> this was actually, before they turned it into a guild, this was just Aragold and Kamihammer's home. Want that? <laughs> that note. Yeah, they live there. That's their home. Ah, uh, yeah, but kind of my bond is I have ancient texts that I hold, bad secrets that must not get into the wrong hands. If I feel like my mind is being messed with me. I have to do something. Yeah. It would be it would be in my nature to try yeah, to do something and research. Together. No, it's fine. No, I know that. That's fine. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm. I understand. I know with you guys. This is not exactly the newest skill, but I got. I I have to get my mind off of it. I do it. Somebody's messing with my head, and I gotta go. Do it. Gotta, Better yourself. And then go whenever you get a chance. Go out more too. It's only been happening mostly around town. Like specifically the town that's been having issues. Is there any, do you guys have any, any of the, any, like, anything about what's going on with the, like, any, just even written down stuff about what's been going on? No, everything so far that we've been writing down has just been accounts. Okay, do you, are they, they're in the file room, right? Yeah, they should be. Okay. Well, I go on. Thanks. Okay. So while you're doing that, we'll hop up to the other two, yeah. okay? So, I'm going to go to the room. Yep. Yeah. I go. I go Guzzle, you see Guzzle going in there as well. He'll help you out. He, he, he manages this file room. He'll help he you out. He thinks I'm a sizist. <laughs> he sure he'll no, help her No, he, he doesn't. He just, he was fucking with you. Hey, Guzzle Gorin, uh... Hey. Anyway, hold on. Let me go to the other two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, buddy. <laughs> Daryl. Yes. You and know, Alex have woken up. Are you guys still heading towards town? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So as you guys are headed towards town, it is very, very, very cloudy. Oh, uh, we're in for a And it's yeah, windy as well. Much. It's also very windy too. Oh. Let's see. Just see today. Be going crazy. Oh boy. It seems like just just really quickly from what the, the rate that we're going. It'd be a lot harder for me to level up at this rate. Oh, by the way, for um, everything that you did in the last part, I'm going to give you roughly 100 experience for. Okay? So add that to what you get. For the, some of the stuff that you did, yes. Oh yeah, I got big and then I got small. That wasn't the only thing you did. You did other things too, but mayor. yeah. The mayor's funny. <laughs> I should have got five experience points for that. So. I should have got five experience points just for that. No. Damn. <laughs> Not even an inspiration. Not even an inspiration. 
Damn, Aubrey. No. You're not No. I would have some. No. I would. I never said you had to. No. Oh boy. Okay. So you start hearing like what you think could be flapping, but you don't know because it's windy. And you also hear what you think could be buzzing, but you don't know because it's windy. <laughs> Daryl? Daryl? Yo. What you do? Uh, I'm going to do a perception check to see if I can pinpoint see, guess the general direction of the noise is coming from, if it is. Okay. If this next part's not as long, we're sorry. <laughs> uh, 14 for perception. Okay. You? Okay, right, you assume because of the wind, it's coming from the trees. You guys also notice that the trees are getting thicker as you go. Just a little bit, not a whole lot. It's like a little, just a little part in the road. Hmm. But you, you hear it coming from like trees and bushes. You're not sure where though. Hmm. Well, this is definitely on my element. Oh, element. <laughs> pick up the pace. Let's pick up the pace and try and head to town before we actually get drenched. Nope. I mean, nope. It started to rain. Nope. Oh, in chowder. Yep. With something you might not want. Well, you might be able to deal with them pretty easily, but... Why is it always them? I don't know. It's because they're outside of the village. No, I mean, like, <laughs> why Why is it always a them that's attacking them? Why isn't it always... Why can't it just be an it? Or a thing. When yeah. I say them... Because it's rude to say thing and it about things. About stuff. Yeah, That's why I say them. That's yeah, naturally how I say it. Yeah, but Aubrey, if you don't actually know the gender and it's usually a creature, you do say it. Or thing. You'd be wrong. You don't yeah. need, that would be a generalization. Well, you'd be wrong. Yeah, this family has cousin it. I love cousins. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just writing notes down and stuff. That was a teenage girl who used to do that. Yeah. I think it's funny that they made a woman. If that was a girl and they made her a womanizer. But cousin it was always a womanizer. Yeah. What was like what? What is he? Is he like literally covered in hair, or is yeah. that just his hair? Like, because when he hair. pulls out his hands, he's wearing gloves, and there's no Cause hair. It's because he is all hair. Oh, he's just like well, hair. How can that be fun? <laughs> you probably spent a fuck ton of shampoo. <laughs> That's the whole thing about it that he does spend a lot of shampoo, and he like shampoo grooming and. Yeah. He's like rich, but he. Probably the episode where he tried to work at a fast food joint. And there's so much hair in all the food. Probably just a net. Too much hair, then you know It's itself as a net. It just becomes a net. <laughs> anyway, um, as you guys are walking, suddenly it gets suddenly darker. Like darker than it should be when it's cloudy. It's like. It's like nighttime at day. As a bunch of these weird looking things start flying at you guys from the trees. Yes, you say. 
Qu'est-ce que c'est Comment ça va <rire> How you feel it? <rire> ça va bien. Du, du, du mon pire. <rire> Tell you that now. <rire> non. <rire> Seems you're pretty weak, actually. <laughs> well, when they're this weak, I don't know if I would be able to kill you guys. <laughs> But if I do, it's gonna be fucking funny. Because it shouldn't. <laughs> it really shouldn't. Anyway, they have. <laughs> Stop laughing. He kind of knows what it might be. No, it's not that. It's not that the thing. This horrid flying creature looks like a cross between a large bat and an oversized mosquito. It's uh... Its no. legs have uh, ends of sharp pincers, and its long needle-like proboscis uh, is come slashes the air, seeking you guys. How close is it to the trees right now? Ah, uh, well, 40 feet. <laughs> <laughs> you said it was coming out of the trees. They're all coming out of the trees at you guys. Roll initiative. <laughs> We already did. What'd you roll? I got an eight. Alex. Oh no! All right, well, my plan. it's not your guys' turn. It was my plan. Okay, one of them flies. <laughs> one of them flies at uh, Alex and uh, misses its stinger at you. <laughs> The bomber. <laughs> This one's gonna go for Barrel missing, I think. Should make sure. Yep. Even with plus five, it still miss. And then. <laughs> <laughs> uh, two are going for you. Miss. Oh. Miss. Oh boy. Useless. Miss. 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 Oh no, that's a hit. That one's on uh, Alex. He grabs you and latches onto you. The fuck? Okay, that's weird. So grab it grabs onto you, stabbing you, doing three damage. And it's latched onto you, like onto your arm. With its proboscis in your arm, not not pleasant. <laughs> And then next one. Oh, it's now Daryl's turn. And then it's the next one's turn. And them close to the trees. They all are, except for a couple of them that dive bombed you guys. I'll just let me count really quickly. Eight of them are near you guys. How many is near the trees? Four. Yeah, these guys are gonna kill us off. Okay. With two HP? <laughs> Each? I think you're fine. I am casting a spell. Okay. Now here's before I do cast a spell or fail to cast a spell, I need to ask you a question. What? Um. <laughs> this is gonna be fucking hilarious if I pull it off. Oh, 
What's the question here? Do trees have deck saves? It's an objects. Eh? It's an inanimate object. Good. Unless it's a Trent. Which Maybe. is always a possibility. Or a dryad. Or both. Uh, you really want to do that? You can't really, don't you really want to piss off a dryad. With right now. <laughs> I am <laughs> casting a spell. Maximize. Wrath of Storm. Oh, what are you doing? I'm going to blow up one of the trees that's closest to them with lightning. Now where's shrapnel? Oh no. Okay, roll a d100, see which tree you actually hit. I mean the one that's closest to them. Yeah, roll a d100. Told you you're in a thick part of the woods. You say? Yep. Uh, you want me in your room? Uh, Where? Dog is misbehaving again. So, you killed one. I'll tell you that much. You killed kill one. one. Okay. Did you hit? It was a direct hit. It went right through it to hit oh, the tree. Oh, jeez. Pop the fucker. They're all over the place. Leaving nothing but death. Destruction. The tree explodes and hits none of the other ones. No? No, but you do hit something else. Uh-oh. I think he just pissed it off. Yeah, we're on the storm. What is with you in pissing things off today, Daryl? When do I piss something off? <laughs> exactly! Like, <laughs> what is with you in pissing things off, Daryl? Like, come on! <laughs> it may not be your future. And as my bonus action? What do you? Oh no. My hammer. Or should I say my present? At the closest one. <laughs> well, your present. You're throwing your hammer at one? No, it's not as good as a war hammer. Oh, okay. Who okay, cares, Blackie? I've never heard him help. He's upsetty. Should stop being upsetty, though. Upsetty spaghetti. Mm, piss something off, I'll tell you that much. Uh, 12 AC? On one of them, yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, you don't. You miss one. Miss? Yeah, they have 14, the small little fuckers. Yeah. They're small, that's why. Yeah, no problem. Missed. I was like, nope. I'm gonna put her in the your soul. <laughs> Alright, next is this one. It's gonna fly at Daryl. It hits Daryl. Sure yes, because it's plus five. It's gonna hit sure you. Maybe? Yeah, it's a hit. I'm sure. Sure, did take one of the others. Take what others? <laughs> Fucking fuck. Take uh, five damage. Take five damage and it's, latched, and it's lashed on to you. All right. Well, two more coming at you guys. But something is moving. Oh no, what could it be? No, no, no. Tires and tires and bears, oh my. Things are gonna die. 
Oh boy, this is gonna be fucking funny. This is what happens when you piss something off. I need one of you to roll a wisdom safe. Do it right now, Daryl. What? Wisdom safe. Wisdom? Yep. That's my highest. You know, I said that, watch me fail. I'm like, damn, bring a fuck. Seventeen. You're good. <laughs> what? Piss something off, but I couldn't do anything to you, so. What did you do to me? Oh, this is just you wait. <laughs> wait, don't worry, you're a pretty little head. <laughs> what? It's gonna happen. It, it, it's gonna happen. Daryl, you're getting more things coming at you. We're a video, that's a video ahead, he said. That's a hit. Alright, Daryl. This is going to take another some damage. Two. Five damage again. Is it two or five? Five, because it's plus three. Two plus three. Alright, so now they're all in range. They should all be, yes. Except for one, because it's dead. <laughs> um, but they're all like flying near you guys, except for you guys both have one in each of you. You have two in you, and he have one in you. So, that's fun. It's uh, also your turn. Finally. You're literally the last of the list. Oh, yay. That helps a little bit. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's the range on it? On uh, what? How, how far are they exactly? Five feet. You're surrounded by them, dude. They're well, on you. First, I'm going to squash the one that's on you. Okay. <laughs> I can say evil things. <laughs> fucking mosquito fuckers. Angry dog barking for no fucking reason. Evil thing. <laughs> squash them. <laughs> okay, roll CP hit. What'd you roll? Two. <laughs> oh no. Head it. It's fuzzy and weird. It's like, why did I touch this thing? <laughs> so I can attack it again? Yep. It's a strength. For your attack bonus. Fourteen. Defender bonus. What are you doing out here? Me? He wanted to take no from me. <laughs> and he wouldn't shove his face back in the room. So it was when I tried to hold him. Dog, lay down. Lay down. You need sleep. Lay down. Good dog. Lovely. Stay. Alright. Um, that's your turn? Yeah. 
Do you attack it again? With your extra attack, or? No, with my extra attack, I'm gonna cast, uh, Moonbeam. Oh boy. Right in front of me. And it's like four of them you're gonna hit. Cause it's a two by two square, right? Four by four. Right. That's a big square. Hit them all. It, it was big enough to go right through this temple. Oh. Oh no. Right in front of me. Where I'm just out of the range of it. Okay. Oh no. If you put it on top of you, they would have all died. Do you get hurt when you get? Yes, okay, then I wouldn't do that. <laughs> yeah, so I saying, if you put it on top of you, they're gonna roll all the Yeah, I will. You're gonna put it on top of you? Yeah, That means Daryl's getting hit by it. Yep. You're yeah, getting hit by it, and they're all getting hit by it. I can take it. It's a lot getting hit by this shit. <laughs> and <sighs> Talk about pest control, Jesus Christ. No, it hits all my man, you gotta roll as much damage you does. Do you wanna see what these things look like, by the way? You told me about them. They Ooh, look pretty eggs. Damage. No, they're all dead. Max damage? They're they're all dead. Max damage. <laughs> they're all dead. Just just pop 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 pop. Wait, wait. How, how much is all the damage at max? Max damage is It, wait, well, that, that hits every individual thing? Oh, okay, so they're, they're all dead. <laughs> Everything dead. that comes into it? Dead, 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 dead. You guys are surrounded in ashes. And we take 12 damage. Both take 12 damage. And also, they all disperse. You're surrounded by ashes now. Okay. Still one. Well, it's well, it's not. Me. The fight's not over though. There's okay. still one more thing. The thing he angered. Yeah, you guys gotta still deal with the thing that Daryl angered. Yeah. I didn't do no such thing. Yeah, he did. Yeah. It was a storm. <laughs> Yeah, no. fuck you. This is my cost. I really like that. And Aubrey's like, yeah, fuck you. This is my cost. Alright. Suddenly, vines start appearing all underneath you guys, and you're all entangled. Cannot move. As a dryad comes out of a tree. Ha ha ha! And it's angry. Of course she is. Yeah. Or is it a he? It's a he. Oh. Right, it's mostly females. Yes, but there can be males. Yes, I know. And that's a form of torture if they, because you're stuck as a riot for eternity, basically. You're entangled. So males are pissed. This is upsetting. You're going to if you don't do anything. You get out of this Um, fucking thing. Yeah, strength check. Party, he would have noticed that dryad. Yeah, probably. It's angry. It's an angry thing. It's going to be angrier than you think. That's his turn, by the way. So, Daryl, it's your turn. I know, I'm just waiting. Stop. Wait faster. Like, come on now. Yeah. Daryl, can you pass me a cock to please? We're going to bed. I know, we're trying yeah. to hurry. Try. Yeah, it's not going to be a long episode. Watch some really nasty hentai. Yeah. 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 Yeah
Anyways. Why? <laughs> not? Why not? Why not? Yeah, like why not? Question mark? Like, I don't see why not. Hentai Senpai. Yeah. Screw Netflix nice. and chill. Hentai Senpai. <laughs> That's funny. Nine. Ha <laughs> Welcome to Nine. Ha <laughs> you trap. You fuck. Thing is, it's not gonna burn the branches, the vines. You guys are just stuck being burned oh, by yeah, your old thing. It's not your turn. It's Daryl's turn, so he has to do a no, concert. No, when I got entangled, I had to do a constitution. Oh, yeah. Upper Doug, you chose. He's finally being good. Hey, don't you my toes. Yeah, he's finally being good. <laughs> Same, leave me alone. He does that when he wants to be left alone. That, I know. That's fine. He's biting you, just don't touch. Anyway. You're good. So it's now Daryl con save and a strength save. Yeah, it's two con save too. Yep, con from beans. 18 on the die plus 3, so that'd be a 21 for con save. Succeed? Yep. Yep. Know what I'll do? Strength? You still take six. half damage. So it takes about half damage. Yep. Alright. You said it's strength? You take half of the level. So five. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. You get out of the entangle. You're burning though. Uh seventeen plus four will be a twenty one. Yeah, you're out. You managed to get yourself untangled, but now you're on difficult terrain. And that's your turn, unfortunately. I'm pretty sure. Unless you can, you can use your extra attack. This thing actually doesn't hit hard. Um, I still have a bonus action. My spear, my spear's hammer still out. Mm -hmm. This thing doesn't actually have very many moves. But uh. But it has spells, so that's fine. I'm not going to swing out the dryad with it just yet. Dude. Mm, Turn pissed off. Angry dryad. I don't know, dryad, I didn't mean to piss that off. Angry dryad. Angry dryad. Angry dryad. It was either that or a trend. Yeah, the dryad's a little bit easier to deal with, considering it actually has a conscience. Like, Trends just are, mindlessly kill shit. Yeah, if they're angry. They're, they're, they're pissed off. Like, I mean, you can reason with a Trent, but you gotta be kinda evil. They're not evil. They're neutral. They're neutral. Are they? Yeah. Um, Every single one I met kinda well, you can leave right and fucking kill because you. Because you, know, you, up here. you <laughs> either pissed <laughs> them off, or you went into a territory you well, shouldn't. Yeah, well. We'll have. Well, tell the DM, stop, uh, tell the DM, stop sending me in weird places. <laughs> <laughs> it's your own fault, too, I know, I walked into the goblin bar myself. That was your own fault. She would not say no. <laughs> she would not, not let you say no. You're still in the bar, too, eh? Hmm? You're still in the bar, too. Yep. Um, was that your turn, by the way? Nah, 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 nah. If you die to this fucking thing, I I lose respect. <laughs> just a dryad. It's actually not. Yeah, it's not actually. It's just an average creature to fight. It's not bad anyway. It's fact, it's a kind of... challenge rating one. <laughs> yeah, so if you guys die to this thing, I'm disappointed. <laughs> Level six. Level full, almost level six characters or level five characters. Like, <laughs> if you were fighting like ten of these, that'd make more sense. But... 
I am casting a spell around us. Where are you now? Fog cloud. Oh boy, it doesn't fucking care. <laughs> it can see you through plants. It's fog, it's dense, it can't see through it. Keep in mind, the vines are still by us. It's, it's a fucking tree creature. I know the what I mean. Vines, you're stepping on them and stuff. Okay. Make a con save. Hey. What does it need to be? 16. <coughs> uh, uh, no, it fails. Maximize. Da, da, da. Be 22 damage thunder wave. <laughs> Did you read the health on it, Lee? I read the health on it. That's like, it's already dead now, isn't it? It's 22? It's dead. <laughs> Literally, you guys. Seriously, that's overkill and half. <laughs> you just smack it once and it's dead. <laughs> Boom! That was nothing for you. For God's sakes, you're killing a sacred tree. Creature. No. no that tree is you, usually the, if they, you get turned into a dryad, that tree was semi, semi sacred. Yep. Well, I guess no one's being turned to a dryad today. Kind of just killed one. Okay. Fuck. Shit all over the place. <laughs> I got that. I'm gonna try and do some tallies really quickly for yeah. you guys. Yeah. Daryl exploded so much in this game, he, he wanted to start exploding things instead. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Of the parrot. <laughs> it is still funny though. A tempest. Thor is my god, actually. Fuck, math is hard. <laughs> it can be. Yeah. It's a lot of things that I use. Eh. Math! <laughs> I swear on my question my question. <laughs> That's actually not a lot. Alright, so between you guys you guys both get two hundred experience. That's for the entire encounter. Because all the stir uh stringes are like twenty five each and there were twelve of them. So, 300, and <laughs> the dry ad was 100. No, it's 200 experience. It's 100. No. So it's right here. Oh no, it is 200. Oh, okay. So it's, so it's 500 divided by, so you guys both get 100 and, uh, 250? Yeah. Math is hard. <laughs> Fucking math. Fucking fuck you math. So after this interesting encounter you guys had and caused, it starts to rain. And it's very windy. And you're still at least two miles from town. Fuck. I'm gonna deactivate my Yeah, you probably should. Yeah, I'm gonna deactivate that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, on the, what I was gonna do too is gonna be really funny. On this next turn, on its next turn, I was gonna make it pass without a trace, and it would have been fucking funny. Just fucking leave. <laughs> Be like, ah, no experience for you, fuckers. <laughs> Insta kill. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> I need sixty. <laughs> And then you'll be at the same level as everybody. Uh-huh. Nice. Except for Lee. Well, Lee's the same level. I'm level five. I'm here. Cool. I already thought I was at level four. Yeah, I thought too, Sue. 
But no, she's a level five. It's just I didn't miss that many games. I need sixty. He missed that many games. <laughs> he did. <that. laughs> so okay, so you guys heading back? It's raining now and it's very windy. Yeah. Dive out and the only thing we do is dive it out and trot back to down. Yep. Soaking wet. Hey. So as you guys are heading back to town, the rain picks up. When you guys get a mile there, got one more mile left. But on the way, the rain picks up even worse. Mm -hmm. Daryl, you should be having flashbacks right now. Oh yeah. To the amount of rain that's happening right now. Your perception, you have to roll. Even your passive perception has to be rolled. Now that's how bad the rain is. It's coming down. In other words, it's a sheet storm. Yep. I was wearing all my crazy Minecraft zero. <laughs> Where's my raft? <laughs> <laughs> so it's coming down really fucking hard. Mm -hmm. uh, Lee, you hear it raining that fucking hard. I look up from your. <laughs> yeah. It's raining really fucking Kinda, hard. Kind of, it freaked me out, so I'm getting a little obsessive of what the hell is messing with my mind. Well, Guzzlegorn could answer that question. They assume it's the spire in the middle of town. Yeah, but assumptions, assumptions, assumptions. Well, it only these things only started happening when the spire appeared. Yeah, but I also thought dwarves and fucking gnomes talk to each other in the they same fucking, you know, the same but language. But not the same language. Gnomes talk in gnomish. Yeah, but you kind of figure that would be... And dwarves talk in dwarven. Oh yeah, gnomes live on the surface dwarves. Yeah. That's not true. Gnomes still live on the ground too. That's definitely racist. <laughs> <laughs> You <laughs> no. <laughs> She's trying to figure who's on bottom, who's on top. <laughs> That's funny. Anyway. <laughs> no more racist. Don't call me a fucking racist. Not racist. Say we were calling you a racist. We're calling you things that just end with ist. <laughs> Biased. Biased. <laughs> Sizest. <Yeah. laughs> it's the it family. <laughs> I don't know what's worse. It's family or the it family? Or both. You could be both. Just two halves are in a family. Usually they have different last names. Mm hmm. So, yeah, that exists. Um, <laughs> so, while it's raining really hard, you can notice that it leaks a little bit in here, but not enough to cause any issues. Is there, like, to, no damages? Any no, it's just it gets very wet, and then eventually puddles build up, and then it soaks through the wood. But it doesn't damage the wood. That much it just soaks through, so there's like a tiny bit, it's like, like on the walls, kind of like when you have a wet when your can is really cold. And it starts to condensation. Yeah, it's like condensation. But then it actually makes the damage. Over time. I know too much about copper shirt. Anyways. It's fine. It's, fine. it's good because they are improving this place every time mon more money comes in. Uh. So you don't, you, we, it, sorry, it still messed me up. English failure. English failure. <laughs> Those are going, like, what's going on here? We need to. That's what we're trying to find out. We've been trying to find out for weeks, months. Okay, um, have you researched any of the, any of the, symbols on the spiral? There the are no symbols. It's completely jet black. What about the other places that we were going to? What are they? That had 
that um, that had symbols on them. You mean like the spot, like the obelisk? Yes, like the obelisk and... Those are tied to something else. Control our spells would detect it. Yes, but we're dealing with it as is. Oops. It's either that or we're having problem with uh, problems with just magic in general. That's what we're still trying to figure out, Alex. You've yet to find anything. Oh, that was just, uh, that was just documents about our guild. Just oh, to, okay. Yeah. So there's nothing, like, there's no, okay, oh. Is there anywhere in town that has a book, library, anything? Yeah. Research? Yeah, of course there's a library. Don't think you'll find much. The mayor kind of cut a bit of funding on the library. Yeah, but at the same time, it's this city's library. It will have information about the city. This is library. a town. This the town library. It's the town's library. We'll find out anything at least before we even showed up, before the guild showed up. Well, you would, but not much. Not on this subject. We already checked, uh, Alex. We were checking the libraries, we were checking our records, everything. What about we the even, history of the underground? What would be underneath here? There's nothing underneath us. Obviously, if there's a giant spike that came up in the middle of town. Uh, yeah, that was not there before. Underneath us. What did you it came out of the ground. It the only way we there's mines underneath the town. They get refilled if we find nothing, and we found nothing under our town, so we keep just digging deeper and going off out of town. We found nothing, nothing in the records. We even asked Gord. We found nothing. Sorry, it's just freaking me out. That's freaking everyone out. We're all stressed. At this time, at this time, the cleric and the paladin have entered the the guild. I didn't get it anyways. What would you roll? Oh, nice. For what? Nice guy's spot, isn't it? Oh. Yes, I'm in my room and I'm dabbing a bath. You guys are soaked, by the way. Yeah, he said I'm grabbing a bath. I'm taking, got my room, take my armor off, all my clothes off, I'm having a bath. And get There's no clothes. bathroom in your bedroom. What? There's no bathroom. No well, bathroom. I'm finding a bathtub and I'm soaking. Right. I'm having a bath. It's a good thing they're still building the bathroom. And luckily they already put the roof on the bathroom and walls. <laughs> it's just not insulated. So I've been going to the bathroom in a bathroom with no roof. With no insulation. Okay. Well, I was there before. Yeah. Just no insulation. Okay. They had to move the old bathroom. To make way for him. For other things, not just him. Her, sorry, the beard. <laughs> Gotta have that joke back sometimes, man. Like, yeah, yeah. Alright, so what are you doing, Alex, now that you're back and soaking wet? I'm 
gonna go to bed. Alright. <laughs> dry up. Alright. <laughs> Lee, well, it's getting late. Are you still doing the? It is late in the game too. Yeah. It, uh, it, you can't really tell what the day, what time of day it is because of how rainy it is. It's a stupid. Hey, I had a, it, it's been a long day. I'm gonna get some food and we'll we'll figure this out in the morning. We'll I'll go to the freaking library or something. I, who knows? You never know. You, you could always find something in a book. You can always find something. Little tiny minute detail you never even Question, thought of. Question, do I hear this? Yeah. This is as you're heading to bed. Hey, Al. Hey, Alex. Oh, my God. Hey, you guys. What? What's up? Where the heck are you guys? Oh, wow. Is Long. that... Oh, uh, don't touch him! Don't touch him! Don't touch him! They got or hey. they 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 got some orc on them, like dirty orc. And... God, what is on you? It's a little bit of everything. Like I said, we've had a few encounters. Oh, you okay. especially go for a shower. I'm having a bath. Oh yes, you go. You what? What is being going on? Whole lot of stuff. <laughs> well, I, I can tell. At least you wasn't in, like, my freaking day. I literally saw her husband. Or, sorry, your fiancé. By the way, I see your fiancé. Do you want to hear this? Yes. I turn around and... So you what? So, um... Uh, I was walking back from the mayor's... City Hall, and I saw your husband. I saw your husband walking down the street, clear as day. Like, I could go out. Where? I don't know. You don't remember where. He went down to an alleyway. I can show you the alleyway, but. Okay. It's, it's pouring rain. I don't give a shit. I don't think she's gonna go. I. Can't we just go in the morning, literally, after I went to go chase... Look, I tried to chase after him to go find him for you. I went down the alley, and I went to go see where he was. And then, when I went down the alley, it wasn't him. It turned into my own father. It was nothing, and then your father showed Yeah, it was nothing, and then my dad was just there. My father's been dead since I've been a tiny child. You don't understand, like... I need it. I turn around and walk back like towards a, the bath. <laughs> you take, you take a bath. I'm gonna, we, we'll do this you in the morning. Need some mead at this point. Yeah, I, I need food. <laughs> all right, so everyone does their normal daily stuff, and I hope you guys all enjoyed this. We're gonna end it here. Say goodbye, Daryl. Bye, Alex. Bye. E. Bye. And we'll see you guys all in the next video. Doop doop doop. Bye.